Okay, so I have updated the CPU micro code that Intel has rolled out uh, for my motherboard today, and I wanted to do a little small test to see uh, whether or not it actually did uh, impact performance. Um, and the results are in, and I have lost performance. Um, and it's really sad as uh, an, uh, being an overclocker and uh, seeing the numbers go down uh, quite a bit. And this is just one test. Um, there will be more more tests to come out, um, and we'll, there will be more people doing reviews on these uh, to see what has happened. So what has happened to my motherboard is that I have a CPU microcode that Intel has rolled out for me. It's called F9A. I am currently using the Z270X Gaming K7, and it is a microcode update for the security uh, loophole, the, the, the problems with Meltdown. I'm pretty sure Spectre hasn't been addressed in this one, which will be eventually addressed as well. Uh, and here are the results. Okay, as an overclocker, this this looks awful for me. I, I hate numbers going down. Oh, this is not cool, man. This is really, really, really uncool. As an overclocker, I never want to see this sort of stuff. Right now, I'm using a safe overclock uh, of 4.8 gigahertz on a 7700K. You can see here, 7700K. It doesn't address that number here for some reason, but I'm using a 7700K overclocked to 4.8 and I go from 1091 down to 1038. This is after two tests. This is this is the average, I guess you would say. Um, it's closer to, I guess, accurate. Um, this is with the desktop, literally no applications turned on at all, literally doing nothing. And I'm pretty sure with this one on, I had some sort of hardware monitoring going on. So this is the best case scenario for the CPU at 4.8. So it goes from 1091 all the way to 1038. Ooh, I don't like that. That is not cool. Okay, so that is an average decrease in improvement. Uh, in performance of 5.1 ish 5.1 percent that's not good man that's really not cool and I, I'm telling you the overclocking community is gonna be so pissed because you're gonna start seeing some some uh, some really weird testing and I don't know how they're gonna how they're gonna like uh, regulate like, people who have the update, people who don't have the update. Now, I believe this is just for Meltdown. I'm not sure. I haven't looked up all of the details, but I know this is a security patch because the performance has gone down significantly. So this is from 4.8, 4.8. They're both 4.8 gigahertz, but one is much slower than the other. Ugh. This is, this is not cool, man. Like, this is really bad stuff. This might be the first time you've seen this. But wow, that's that's a uh, that's not good. I hope this this helped your decision making on what CPU you really want to have. Um, might want to go with the Red Team, but Red Team's also releasing a update for their security flaws as well. So we'll, we'll see how both of them uh, fare with the security updates so far. But I'll keep you posted. This is just one test. This is the first test that I've done. We'll see. All the other tests that get much, much slower. Oh, man. This is just one test, okay? Th this could be best case scenario. Oh, man. All right. Hope this informed you. Uh, I just want to make a small video about it. Um, wait to update your BIOS, okay? Just wait. There might be more. There might be something different that has happened, all right? Just, I will keep you posted.